Good morning. <laughs> oh, you know me so well. You know that when I have this smile on my face, I'm ready to misbehave. Oh, you're not gonna let me? Hmm. <laughs> What's to say that you have the power to do anything? Oh. <laughs> you know, words are just words. You can say them all you want, but if you don't act behind them, they're never going to be believable. So, if it makes you feel better, you can keep on talking. But I'm going to do my own thing. Because why? Because I want to. Oh, you're getting so angry, aren't you? Of course you are, I can just tell. <laughs> Aw, are you just going to try to ignore me? I think the both of us know that that's not a good idea. Especially for you. Well, yeah. You always say that I never get under your skin. But I think you know on how persistent I can be. And I always get my way. And I can just tell just by mentioning that you're getting so angry with me. I'm being a brat? Hm, it's what I'm best known for. So ignore me all you want. I'll find a way regardless. Remember last time? And the time before that? And the time before that too? Oh, not going to acknowledge that, are you? Well, that's too damn bad. I will always be your favorite little nuisance. And there is nothing you can do. Nope, nothing at all. So you might as well just allow it to happen. It's for the better anyway. You can finally accept the fact that I can do whatever I want, and you can't control me. Oh. <laughs> just thinking about that boils your blood, doesn't it? Not being able to keep me in check, watching me do whatever I want, having no control. It's just one of those things you can't tolerate, huh? Hmm, still playing the silent game, are we? You're stubborn. But hey, so am I. And I think that's why we were meant for one another. To test each other's limits. To experience everything from one another. Whether it's love or annoyance. Or maybe a healthy combination of both. That's what we are. A little couple that just annoys each other so much to the point where we feel the need to punish one another. <laughs> I know you're not ignoring me. If you were, your face wouldn't be getting this red. And your body wouldn't be reacting the way it is. I know you enough to understand that your body is way more honest than you are. You don't particularly like to admit things, whether it's defeat or how you honestly feel. But right now, in this very moment, I can tell, even though I'm being so bratty, you feel the need to take care of me, as you usually do. You always want to make sure that I'm doing okay, that I'm behaving, that I take all of my vitamins. Which, I haven't, by the way. And to all of that, I say, I really, and I mean really, appreciate you. Well, of course. Everything that you've done was to make sure that I was okay. But you know me. I am your bratty little girlfriend. I will not go down without a fight. Aw, does that make you upset? Well, good. Maybe you should do something about it. Oh, that's right. You can't do anything. Nuh-uh. Oh, you want to prove me wrong? Well, if you could have, why haven't you already? What's taking you so long? 
It seems like you want to do it anyway. So what's the holdup? Don't tell me. You're scared. Oh, yes, you are. If you weren't, you wouldn't be hesitating. What's wrong? Did my brattiness finally get to you? Oh. <laughs> and here I thought you were the dominant one of the relationship. It was your job to put me in my place. Yet, here you are, struggling to do so. I will say, this new little hesitant nature is very... How do I put this? It looks very good on you. Yeah, no need to be ashamed. Yeah, yeah, you're the more dominant one of the relationship, but in this moment, I don't think so. Because I think the both of us know that the more dominant one wouldn't be hesitating, wouldn't be so scared. Because, let's be honest, it wouldn't make any sense for someone who's considered the dom to look as scared as you. I just think you don't want to admit to something. But you know me, your little bratty girlfriend. I tend to know many details about you. So no matter what you're hiding, I'll figure it out. Oh, so now you want to show your little defiant side. I know that side of you all too well. And right now, you're using it to protect a side of you that I'm not particularly familiar with. A side that you want to hide from me. <laughs> you know better than anyone that I get what I want. You know, I've always loved your strong personality. Every single time I've gotten bratty, you always put me in my place. That's something that I adore about us. Our little secret dynamic. Where it's just the two of us, annoying one another constantly. I've grown to love your level-headed self. But I gotta admit, I'm starting to like your more hesitant side. But don't you worry, even though I can get a little overbearing at times. I will always love you, no matter what you are. Oh, <laughs> still denying that you don't have a submissive side? Oh, well, that's not good to lie to yourself and to me. I don't think I need to remind you how much I dislike it when someone lies to me. So... <laughs> But even if you choose to lie to me, I will have you figured out. And from what I can see, my brattiness has gotten to you, hasn't it? It's gotten so overbearing that you can't even take it anymore. You can't even bring yourself to put me in my place. Which tells me, I won the war. You are waving the white flag. I never expected someone like you to surrender. You put up such a good fight. You wanted to put me in my place all this time. Yet you can't even bring yourself to do it anymore. I wonder why. I think the both of us know exactly why. Well, of course. It seems... You. Yes, you. You're not really dominant, are you? You call yourself a brat tamer, but you can't even handle one to begin with. I think you're just putting up a front. And in reality, you're just like me. You want someone to tell you what to do, to tame your attitude. So what do you say? How about we switch the roles for today? Oh, <laughs> as much as you want to deny it, you know deep down inside, you're just as much as a brat as I am. So allow yourself to be who you truly are.